Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to the Infected version 12. Today is a huge day. <laughs> Today we are going to make the advanced workbench, the advanced tools, and possibly the circular saw. It just depends uh, on how many uh, parts and stuff and things we have. So we have all of those. Uh, 16 electrical, 10 uh, mechanical, and 10 plastic. Uh, the sooner that we can get power and get oil going. How much oil do we have? Oh, my goodness gracious, we're going to be hungry. We have 15 oil. That's enough to make plastic, but it's not enough to left over to run the circular saw. All right, so let's start out uh, by eating. It is uh, 8, 12 a.m. It's going to be rainery. I don't care. Uh, let's start with water, and we'll go back to water because he's just too thirsty. Uh, oh, God, there's a Bambi right outside. Uh, we have a meat stew. That will do quite a lot. I missed him. <laughs> Where is he going? Where are you going, Bubba? I hit him that time. Missed him that time. <laughs> There we go. Uh, that spike should have been the, the death knell for him. I lost all those arrows, but it's okay because, uh, except for something, this one, uh, it's okay because we're going to make bone arrows. There is a sticko. All right, boy, it's going to be super dark today. Mm. I dropped down uh, the uh, blueprint for the garage. Uh, I think that's where I want this one to be. Uh, we'll build another build, but it's right at the end of the road. It's not perfectly straight, but it's okay. I didn't even know that there was like support braces under there. I've never noticed that before. Uh, we don't have the ability, well, we kind of have the ability to make it, but we don't have the truck yet, so super not yet important. I just wanted to know where to put it. All right. I forgot to mention uh, when I was telling you guys about this greenhouse, um, after you get the plants in here, you can move the greenhouse until winter time, and then the plants will get watered, but uh, we're okay. I, just, I have two tanks, probably could use four. We'll get around to that. We need to make a gate and a fence, because this is irritating for me. We have just a ton of stuff to do today. Let's get rid of this. There we go. All right, now then. Advanced workbench. Um, I think that I want to put in uh, these guys first. I would like them to be straight-ish. should be. Uh, let's just do one for the advanced workbench. <laughs> that is, <laughs> that takes like a very, very specific angle right there. Alrighty. Oh, this is exciting stuff. Uh, workbenches, uh, advanced workbench. It is a thing of beauty. Let's see what we need to cook for that. Uh, we need to cook uh, two copper. I believe I have that many iron. Uh, yeah, right there. Um, copper, copper, copper. Copper. I think I need to eat some more food. We'll go ahead and... Oh, he gave me an oil. Oh my gosh. He really likes me. All right, let's go. <laughs> Let's cook two coppers up. We also need nails. I think I have. I think I have nails somewhere. Right there. I have 70. Alrighty. We only need 10. 
and uh, 10 planks. That I don't have. Unless there's some in the house. There's two, four, six. If there's four planks in the house, then we're golden with that. Oh. <laughs> there is three. <laughs> All right, so let's just like chop down a tree here. <laughs> Alrighty, I am super looking forward to going uh, to the next uh, town, and uh, I was going to be doing that today, but of course we found the advanced uh, workbench, and I mean, that's everything right there. There we go. This is like the, uh, the lightning for all saves, I think. I think it's pretty darn good stuff. We need to uh, put up a little bit more light. It's very dreary at night and it's gonna get worse because it's almost winter time. Very cool. Now we can make uh, mechanical parts and electrical parts and many, many, many parts. Uh, all right, let's get rid of all of this. Goodbye, goodbye. Uh, I made a bone spear, which I could have made weeks ago. <laughs> Maybe a week and a half ago. All right, let's look in Itempedia. And under weapons, we're going to go to steel. Uh, that's a bolt. Uh, steel. We need um, a steel spear tip, which is a steel ingot. Okay, we will grab that. I made a little bit of aluminum so that I could make a uh, can. So I could make cans as I needed. All right, plunk that in there. Um, we need um, uh, three sticks, five plant fibers, iron axe. We need an iron axe head, which is three irons crafted on the anvil. One, two, three. I'm really excited about this stuff, you guys. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell. And uh, I think the uh, pickaxes, two of them. Let's check. One, two. There's the pickaxe. All right, now then. The uh, iron. Uh, Itempedia. Iron axe, we need just a stick crazy. Look at this raccoon. He was irritating. There we go. Iron axe. Uh, is it the same for that? It is. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Let's find something. Find, find something, anything here. Here's something. <laughs> yes. Four choppos. It's uh, only two, I believe, for the little ones. Boom! Very cool. And uh, the pickaxe also reduces uh, the amount of uh, picking and axing. What are we doing that for? We don't know. It doesn't matter. Uh, what was next? Oh, the steel spear. There we go. Now for that, we need the spear tip, which is made on the anvil. One steel. And um, then we need, you don't make these things very often. Um, and uh, as soon as we have a grinder, we won't make these things again, ever. <laughs> uh, three sticks, five plant fibers. Plant fibers, that's in the barking fibers box. Oh, I already have 23. Um, yeah, going to fit. Split, split, and let's come over here. Uh, three and three. Oh my god, you guys. That thing is brutal. 
<laughs> see if we can see any glint from it. Probably not. <laughs> uh, bone arrows. Let's see here. If I was a bone... There we go. Uh, that's only 29. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how many one... Is it three... Five. I don't even know how to make these things, apparently. Let's look it up. <laughs> um, that is right there in others. This is one bone. Oh, regular workbench. I told you guys I could have been making this stuff. Regular workbench. There we go. All right. That makes 32, 35. And 41. There we go. We can only carry 40. And we're going to have to take that out of there. And we'll put it in there. And we'll get the feathers out. And we'll put that. Oh, that doesn't actually even go in there. I wonder if we need rope. Probably. We are about to become killers. That's 23 ropes. We need 40. <laughs> All right. Oops. Uh, higher up. There we go. I'll knock 15 of those back. All right. There we go. Here's that. Now let's look up uh, how to make arrows. Uh, bone arrows, uh, bone feathers, stick, and rope. Oh, you know what? I don't have any sticks. That's enough for two of them. All right. Is it done here? I'm not sure. Boy, that's pretty irritating. <laughs> it's like you have to click it so many times. All right. Yeah, we're going to do it right there. Unless you go really slow. Oh, man. Uh, taste the firepower of my steel uh, spear. Where did he go? There he is. Dead. Oh, come on. <laughs> Not even going to collect those. <laughs> he gave me stone arrows. You know, to be honest with you, that's gotten me through quite a bit. <laughs> <laughs> because four and five, uh, because I uh, I haven't really made a lot of arrows. So the Vambies have been giving me three arrows at a time, which has been awesome. All right, I'll put those ten in there. And now I need sticks. Uh, I don't remember. Let's just do it this way. <laughs> uh, I do not need that raccoon, uh, but I had already a deer, and uh, I had to cut the deer up to put the raccoon there. Uh, I don't know how long an animal will last on that cart, but it appears to be not as long as it will last right there, um, unless I just had a minor little game glitch. That's possible. Five of those. Five of those. There we go. And we'll do that one more time. This time we could split that in half. And there we go. There's another 10. That is 20. It is probably enough. Uh, we'll go ahead and do this last little batch and we'll have uh, 25 arrows which I think is more arrows than I've actually used since the very beginning. Alrighty, because I'm not finding them very effective against the Vambies. That would be my fault. Alrighty, animal parts. Uh, nails. Clay fuel nails, there we go. Put that right there. All right. I don't think I need this much fuel. 
but I'm going to take this much fuel. And, uh, all right, circular saw bench. I think that for right now, I should probably build it out here just so that it is uh, out of the way. Um, right there. Uh, okay, we actually have all that. I just need to cook a couple of cobalts. All right, here we go. I like my steel spear. Pokey pokey. <laughs> uh, cobalt is outside. I am going to try to not overcook that. Well, how many did it say? Did it say two? I don't remember. Here we go. Um, I need to look. And we'll get four of each of these. Oh, oh, oh. And we'll see how much iron we need. Because <laughs> I forgot. Uh, eight iron total, so six more. No problem. Oh my god, that's got to go. <laughs> uh, down there. Five, six. How are we doing food-wise? Yeah, we need to eat. Um, yeah, just two cobalt. All right, let's go get some food. I made plenty. And so we've got canned vegetables. Uh, I think we had this already once before. Adds plus uh, 0.05 uh, to health and sun resistance, which is nice. And uh, fruit salad uh, adds to stamina and thirst, which is nice. I have uh, made one onion soup. Onion soup is a little bit uh, weirdly costly. Uh, oh, I must have used some Barker chips. All right. Um, sun resistance. Right. We have seven potato paste, so let's use it. And let's take one in case of an emergency. All right. We have... Uh, we have plenty of water. We still are hungry. All right, that's good. There's actually water uh, at the extractors. I'm going to take more fuel than that. I feel like if I take um, too little, I'm going to be mad. Oh, oh, ah. There we go. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Let's go out into the wilds <laughs> with our new weapons. And, uh, oh, I forgot to get the cobalt. Wait. <laughs> and the oil. <laughs> All right. So, there we go. Two cobalt. Put out the fire. Uh, oil. Oil is over here. We'll put a full load of oil in. This is so, so magical. Uh, for those of you that don't know this, um, the uh, circular saw actually makes four planks uh, per, um, per log instead of two. And you can just see it pile right up. Zoop. There's four planks right there. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> That's a tree. <laughs> All right, we are just going to uh, run to the extractors. We need to make more extractors. And so uh, we are going to be making uh, three crates of iron. And uh, we'll make uh, one more of each kind of extractor. I do find that later on um, I end up shutting down cobalt and adding to aluminum. It's not like a perfect balance. It doesn't take 
the same amount of cobalt <laughs> for all of this. So, oh, I forgot something. Uh, we only need one, so let's just split one off. I forgot to make the helmet, you guys. <laughs> Why didn't you remind me? That's your job. <laughs> that only needed one, and aluminum is the last one I visited. So hopefully it will only need one as well. I can't believe I forgot the hat. It's not uh, so hot anymore either. It's uh, October. It's probably late October. And uh, so we need to boogie to town. We don't have time to do that today. The towns are like way too far north. <laughs> There's still one in the southeast as well. Ah, clear that thing. All right, I completely forgot about this, you guys. I can't hardly even believe it. Uh, five, six of those. And uh, copper. There we go. There we go, copper. And uh, four, is it four cloth? Where am I? Three cloth. I feel like we're getting away from, getting away with something. Oh, that does say cloth on it, doesn't it? All right, three cloth. What time is it now? Three o'clock already, oh my gosh. <laughs> we really need this helmet because <laughs> it looks like we're gonna get caught out in the dark on our way home. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. Definitely do not need um, any hunting to be done. So this is full. All right. Uh, this is probably, yeah, nine and a half hours. Definitely. That's enough potatoes and eggs. Uh, that's all biofuel. So um, if we waste potatoes on potato pumpkin soup, whatever you want to call it, um, then that's going to suck. And um, we maybe might get a pig and make some more bacon pie. But uh, the best thing of all, of course, is the ration and barring that than stew. But um, there we go. Uh, work a uh, bencho. There we go. There's our hat. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> All right, let's hurry up. Ah! <laughs> I'm going to break a leg. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just, yeah, that's right. <laughs> It's this way. We might make some pumpkin lights since it's October. It's not going to be October for very long. Maybe this episode. Uh, maybe the next one, too. I'm not really sure. We're on day 26. Math stuff. It's 180 minutes math things. Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. I don't worry about it. I just keep going forward. Now, if your time is like at 60 minutes, then you like you need to seriously think about when you're going to be prepared. Uh, we need to make a winter coat and uh, snow pants, which takes like four seconds to make. We already have uh, the biggest survival tool for winter, the greenhouse. Now, the greenhouse is not hard to make. The trick with the greenhouse is getting the copper. And so the second extractor that you make, like I said, when we did it, is copper. You need an iron extractor first to start pumping out stone so that you're not spending time cutting stone. And uh, then uh, 18 iron ingots, depending on how many forges you build. You know, I did want to look at this area. We have been here once before. It's There's a clearing over here. 
Well, not much of one, huh? Is this not where it is? Maybe it's over there. We'll go over there and look. We're supposed to be on our way to aluminum, but I got lost. Dude. Pull it together, man. <laughs> We're going to be pumping up that stamina as quickly as we can. There's a flat area right there. If you take away the trees, not much of a flat area. Hmm. What about over there on that shore? If we built that, oh, there's an island. Oh, that's cool. Is it deep enough to stop the Bambies? No. <laughs> no, it's not. Ah, <laughs> uh, developer. Very clever. <laughs> <laughs> That's not deep enough to stop the vampires. <laughs> but I do like this lake area. If only we had little paddle boats. That would be fun. All right. Let's try to turn around and go the right way. <laughs> more of the lake wraps around over here. So, more pond. That's cool. Now, there's no fish in these ponds. That would be, you know... Interesting, but it's only fish in one pond, and we've only gone fishing one time, you guys. We've had plenty of food the whole time. Uh, we did go fishing that one time uh, just to get us started. I still have the fish, or maybe they went bad. That might be. There's the whoops. I don't see any whoops. I also don't see any sheep. I don't need to kill anything. <laughs> I think that's what went bad was the fish. But God almighty, 26 days. It went bad yesterday. So 25 days. That was, that was a long time. But uh, if you're doing the math and you're like, hmm, well, I sleep at night. And you may have noticed that I do sometimes sleep uh, more hours than necessary. So if we're, if it's 9.30 at night and I'm trying to get us somewhere, you know, there it is over there. There's something yummy over there, though. Whoa. There was a little moment of lag right there. I still need to build this. I haven't done it yet. But you remember the emergency the other day when I was starving? I made that. I think this thing's full. It is. Alrighty. I'll turn on the lamp. Look at this. Very cool. Oh, yeah. We needed to come out here. Let's grab this. We'll leave the rocks there. That looks really cool over there. Can you imagine? I mean, I kind of know what the caves look like. I have like a little relief of them. Not something that I have the ability to share, but um, the little relief that I have of them doesn't exactly show you much. <laughs> it's not like a map, you know? It doesn't work like that. All right, uh, just down the road. Down the road to Cobalt we go. How's our, uh, is that the road? Yeah. How's that paste holding up? I kind of can't believe it hasn't rained. You know? I mean, it's nice that it hasn't rained, but... You know what's really weird is I haven't seen a wolf. And almost every time I've come here, I've been attacked. Or at least seen a wolf. I don't, I don't see any. We'll look at the other side of the road. You just got to watch out for them. Uh, I've also been attacked by and taken out a fox, uh, which is some of the meat that's in the uh, box, the dried meat. 
5.54 p.m. That's why we have a helmet with a light. <laughs> it also provides you some warmth, by the way, uh, if you didn't know that. Uh, we're a couple of degrees above uh, normal here. If you're wearing the helmet inside in a 20 to 3 degree room, you're going to overheat. There's no bears. I shut them off. Um, so we had three bears right away. And then the developer fixed it because the spawn rate was way too high. And, you know, you couldn't get anything done. And uh, so he killed that spawn rate. It was super bad. Let's go up here so we can see. Ah, there's the rain. Um, and then they never came back. <laughs> oh, so several days went by without any bears. And so I finally just shut them off. And I kept meaning to turn them back on. Well, it's almost too late now. So um, they hibernate. We won't see them in the wintertime. You also will not have vegetables. Um, good grief, dude. I need to start working out. Uh, we, we also won't have uh, vegetables in the wild out here. Which is another reason why it's really important to secure food. Alright, what do we got going on here? I built that one here. I put in the door. Have we been back since I finished doing this? Uh, that should be full of water. It is. That's got fuel in it. And we've got a couple of sticks there. And every time I come over here, I make a uh, plank or two. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> all right, that is almost shut down. Wow. It's going to take all four. We'll take the three cobalt and leave the rocks there. It's not really been uh, incredibly long uh, since I was out here. I think it's been maybe a half an hour of playtime. So I didn't take everything. I just took, took the oars. Uh, now then. Uh, no, that's, that's the wrong way. That's the right way. So we need to come all the way out here. Um, I can't decide whether to go here, here, which one of the ones that we have left to do. I think we went there. Yeah. I don't think we've been down there yet. I can't remember. So I think just to avoid a possible error, we'll go do these three first. And we'll start that tomorrow. I hope we have enough time. I might have to carry like maybe the winter coat on me just to like I don't need a bow actually the bow is easier to run with we'll do the bow um, I might carry some winter clothes just in case but I think we've got plenty of time we should have uh, three hours there's some fresh potatoes there's a pumpkin <laughs> So we should have three hours left to go do all of that. And so I'm going to shoot that today. Oh, we're, we're over a half an hour again. I'm going to shoot that today. And so tomorrow, uh, when we come back, we will start out uh, at that northeastern town. And eh, we're not hungry. We're just thirsty. So we'll start out at the northeastern town and uh, see how many electrical and mechanical parts we can get and the two blueprints. And I think that'll be our primary concern. We can make um, a uh, combat vest, item, PDO, armor and clothing. Uh, it is pretty good for winter time, but it's 10 Kevlar. So, unless I come up with the 10 Kevlar, I probably won't do it. Because I'm not going to make Kevlar. I think we covered that. 
uh, last time or the time before, it takes plastic. Uh, three cloth, three plastic, ten plant fibers. So three plastics, kind of expensive when you're trying to build p a power system. And I think, I'm pretty sure that the power is universal still. There's a nice area. What's that located on the map? Right here, this brown area. See, there's kind of a hill in the middle of all those lakes. There's a couple of nice, huge rocks over there, too. This is also a nice one right here between two lakes. It's not very centrally located. Hmm. We want to be kind of close to a town so that we can go back every 10 days and pick up some more supplies. But these two rocks are nice because you know, we could build like a, a bridge across them, you know? And um, let's see here. Just thinking purely of security. Now, obviously the Vambies can get up that if I can do it, they can do it. <laughs> Unless they haven't learned how to hop yet. Oh dear, I ran out of energy with all that silly hopping. <laughs> Bloop. Here we go. All right, let's get home. And uh, when uh, when we come back tomorrow, you will be joining me uh, out at the northeastern town. And uh, yeah, hopefully we get the uh, wind turbine and I think that's probably the most important one I think we already we already have something we have the junction box good grief dude I just want to get home so I can end this episode <laughs> so yeah I think we had we did get the power blueprint and something else. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Come on, dude. Pull it together. I know it's hard, but you can do it. <laughs> there we go. Alrighty. Home sweet home. There it is. Unfortunately, the sun is not up. But now that we have the headlamp, we can... We can shine a light on our little porch. Let's see here. There we go. That's a nice view. All right, really quickly, uh, in this cog area, you can see we've got solar power, no, solar batteries. Um, that was the loom, advanced workbench, circular saw, and the junction box. So um, I think like the most important thing coming up is uh, definitely um, the wind turbine, which is right here. And maybe the water house. Because the water house is a quality of life thing. All right, you guys, I want to thank you all so much for coming along. Uh, we've got just a huge amount of stuff done. It's going to be uh, excellent and uh, much easier. Iron axe, iron pickaxe, steel spear. Uh, bone arrows we are definitely uh, in mid game now and uh, advanced game is definitely power and that's next uh, have a great day bye for now